glamorous kind of winged cat eye type thing and so this is for you guys that like your dramatic winged eyeliner and it's got quite a heavy dramatic lash and I think it's definitely perfect for the upcoming party season because you've got your Christmas parties, you've got Christmas Day, Boxing Day and then you've got New Year's where you might want to do something a bit extra with your makeup and when I was creating this look I didn't really know what I wanted to do. I was going to do something with purples but that didn't really work out very well so I just went with something very neutral because I know neutral colours suit everyone but if you do want to see something with purple or a specific colour then I would love it if you could tell me in the comment section below that would be great so I can try and do that for you guys but without further ado let's get straight into the tutorial so to start with I'm going in with this warm brown shade and it's quite a lot darker than a usual transition shade that I would use but this is what I'm using so I'm just blending it out a little more extra than I usually would and I'm taking that on a big fluffy brush and just starting to work that into the outer kind of crease of my eye and this is where you want to stop you want to keep on the outer side of your eye just so your eyes look a little bit more elongated and then I'm going in with this deeper kind of even warmer brown and putting that a little bit lower than the first shade that I used but keeping it in the same kind of area just a little bit more lower then just taking a pure white eyeshadow and I'm highlighting my brow bone and just packing that colour on there and then I'm going to blend that into the transition shade that I used first and that is just going to help to highlight your brow and obviously blend the transition shade out as well. taking a creamish sort of yellowy shade but more on the cream side and it's kind of shimmery but not really sparkly and I'm just putting that wherever I didn't put the brown so that is like all over the inner two thirds of my eyelid and on the inner corner and on the outer kind of portion I'm keeping it a little bit closer to the lash line just to keep it that elongated look. Now starting with the eyeliner, obviously you can do your eyeliner however you usually wear it but for this look I wanted to make my eyes look a bit more elongated so I obviously lined my lash line with the eyeliner but then when it came to doing the wing I dragged it quite far to the side instead of straight up towards my brow I took it out sort of not quite towards my ear but kind of in between my brow and my ear kind of area. I know that sounds strange but that's just what I did and I brought it quite far into the inner corner and then lined my tight line and waterline with a black hole liner. Then going back with the shade that I started out with I am going to blend this onto the lower lash line with a small definer kind of brush just so I can keep it really hugged in nicely to the lower lash line then taking a bit more of the darker colour I am keeping that even closer to the lash line and just blending it there and then doing the inner corner I just use the same technique as I would do my eyeliner just going a little bit slower and you want to make it quite thin in that area and not so thick because then it can just take away from the effect so you just want to keep it quite thin in the inner corner this is what it looks like with and without eyelashes I just wanted to show you that so I'm taking some very long wispy lashes and then I'm also using some outer corner lashes on the outer corner of my eye because obviously the lashes are a focus of this look and I wanted to do my lashes to be really intense because I've never tried it before so that is it for the look, I hope you enjoyed it, if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos.